Many First Nations communities in northern Canada are accessible only by air. Fresh produce is prohibitively expensive. As a result, the rate of diabetes in some communities is as much as 25% of the population. This year, for the Aviva Community Fund project, ADRA Canada is proposing a greenhouse for the Bearskin Lake First Nations community to help them grow fresh produce a full nine months of every year. My name is uh, Garth Wesley Nothing. I'm the health director for Bearskin Lake First Nation. Bearskin Lake First Nation is situated about 280 miles, 450 kilometers around there north of Sulacout. On reserve population is approximately 470. Um, there's about around 80 of them, maybe more, that are diabetic. And this includes little children. I've been a diabetic myself for, uh, I'm guessing about 18 years now. Just changing my diet alone, I was able to lose 65 pounds in 90 days. I was using smoothies uh, for breakfast and for lunch and then um, just a healthy meal in the evenings. What it did for my diabetes as well is it improved greatly up to the point where my A1C readings would drop right down to a place where they call pre-diabetic. And I went off two kinds of insulin and a lot of other medications. So it improved my health. We need to provide uh, some access to healthy vegetables to all the people. We're only accessible by air at the moment with winter roads, maybe three months at the most. Having access to healthy, affordable, nutritious food, it's just not here. Uh, the only thing they can afford is eating uh, processed food, pasta, a lot of pasta and pop. So they're not very healthy and uh, they become diabetic just um, pretty fast. There's a growing trend of people want to be healthy. They want to eat healthy. So I wanted to do something about that. I wanted to get some greenhouses where we can at least grow some vegetables. Um, up north here, there's short growing season. So even though people have small gardens, it's not enough and we need to do more. So that's my vision, um, to be able to get the people to have gardening, greenhouses that can provide for the whole community. That's what I would like to see. With ADRA, I am hoping to get uh, assistance, uh, even this uh, greenhouse that I'm talking about. Um, I'm kind of hoping maybe something could be up and running by next summer. You can help the Bearskin Lake First Nations get a greenhouse to provide nutritious vegetables for their community. Share this video, vote for this project, and encourage your social circles to vote too.